Babies. Bunny and Clyde. Babies. Listen. <laughs> Bunny and Clyde. No. Bunny no, and Clyde. Save yourself. Run. Whatever Run. I do, I need you to clone me. So, no, so, he need to be built, baby. So you said. <laughs> he need to be built. All right. So. <laughs> built. So, he needs to be at this point in your life. Bill, we're gonna we're gonna bounce around the question. So we yes. are here. So, all right, at your stage in life, right? Yeah. Would you? I'm just gonna read this one. <laughs> like, yeah. All right. Yeah. Read would it. you? Read it all right. Would you date a grown Uber driver who's no. ambitious, talented, and, and and intelligent who fell on hard times and just hasn't gotten his break? No, no, I'm done with that. <laughs> You he said hasn't no? gotten his break. Yeah. No, I'm 36. I'm not dating no kids. So it's like if you're still waiting for your break, mm-hmm. you're already on the wrong path. We don't wait for breaks over here. Mm-hmm. We go out and get that shit every day. So if you still waiting for something, find somebody else to do it. I'm what if What it. if he's not waiting for it? What if it's um, it's around the corner? Like he's, you're actively. If you're actively yeah, yeah. doing something, you act. You you just gotta have some motion. You gotta mm-hmm. have motion about yourself. You have to have real ambition about yourself. Real hustle about D- yourself. Describe describe there's what no, that would look like. There's no complacency there. If you're not mm-hmm. where you want to be, there's no hanging out. There's no. What you going to sleep early for? Like it needs to be like around the clock. Like I don't mm-hmm. believe in not being where you want to be yet. Just get there. Like mm. just get there. Is so, it that easy though? Yeah. It is. Mm. It is. I don't know. Just get there. Because you on the internet, it's a little bit different. So, but you teach people how to do what you're doing. Yeah. Okay. I do. So, to to piggyback off of your question, oh, mm-hmm. men mm-hmm. typically have this thing where we'll date a woman and we'll build her up, mm-hmm. and you immediately do know. Y'all? I don't know. Immedi- I never had that before, so I don't. You've really never know had that, but let's talk about that. statistically. Typically, I don't it, know. But let's let's look at like life. It's usually a situation where it's a it's a man that will go to he'll pick up a woman from McDonald's just because she's attractive and he'll help build her up, put her on, right? Because <laughs> I never seen this. So you never I've seen really, that. I, I've I've heard a, a lot but of women aspire like even I, the majority of women I know are are dealing with niggas that need to that ain't got. Times are different now. It sounds like that's what it is, but when you really uncover what mm-hmm. it, it looks like, that's it what's like going that. on. But undercover it all, the woman is the backbone. The woman's every the, everything in the woman's name. Every, the woman's handling it all. That's what I know. That's, that's what you the know. World. Yeah. So with that being said, why is I think like typically a, a woman like if you have a daughter, one of the things that you're going to educate her on, or um, you know, ed, uh, like teach her is how to be a wife. And a lot of being a wife, I don't think you're talking about finances as far as like being like the breadwinner. You're talking about finding a good husband, right? Um, uh, being a housemaker, uh, turning a house into a home, right? You think I'm teaching my daughter how to turn a house into a home? You a may not be. You, I'm, no, I'm just asking. Is that what you're implying? Like you think that? That's it sounds what like it sounds like after some experiences, you're probably like, nah, you need to be a boss. You know these niggas like no I, and you know what i get that comment all the time like that, that that's what i'm giving off it's not that okay. type of vibe it's not that type of vibe and i i, I it's funny that you say that because mm-hmm. i hear that so much and i'm like mm-hmm. damn is there like an underlining tone in me that does give off these niggas it's never that i love men i'm not one of them girls that's like i don't need a man no i i need a man i okay. the man is the only thing missing from my life at this point okay. but i don't know if um if my first instinct would be to teach her how to be a homemaker and like all of those things or mm. be a wife to aspire to be those things first. Mm. I think it's so essential to instill in her that her independence mm. and the need to have her own financial resources always. Mm. And that's like my primary focus is making sure that she's never going to have to be reliant on a man mm. to provide her the life that she can create for herself. Because when you truly love yourself and you've built that for yourself, then it's like you're complete in a way. And now you can be a true mm. asset to your partner and you guys mm. can build together. There's no like, you know, so, you know, after that, once you have those skills and mm. that, 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 sec- that financial security of knowing that you mm. have something built and established for yourself then I think you can focus on Dating whatever structure with, the man in your life wants. If he wants you to be able to stay home and raise kids and da 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 cool. But at least you got your own bag and you got your own skill sets in the tuck in case things don't go. A lot of women just get comfortable, you know what I'm saying? It's, it starts off sweet. It's, of course, it's starting off sweet. That's why you're in it. You're starting because mm-hmm. it's good. But things don't always go as planned. And I've seen that too many times to not protect your myself own experiences now. and like your close relationships. Yeah. 